Hi, I'm Dr. Mike Evans. Now, I think most of us know that exercise is good for you, which is true. But another big reason to be active that we don't often talk about is productivity. When we begin our day and, and think we only have so many hours and, and so much on our to-do list, it, it seems counterintuitive to fill up part of the day with doing something other than working. Well, the data shows this thinking is wrong. The data shows regular exercise is part of your job. And by exercise, I don't necessarily mean going to the gym for an hour. As little as 10 minutes of activity counts, and you can do it just about anywhere, like getting off the bus to stop early, walking to lunch, having a walking meeting, walking while on the phone, or, or taking the stairs. Okay, let's dig a little deeper into the science. Let's start with a group that are marked on their achievement every year, our kids. Many recent reviews have shown that increased physical activity improves cognitive performance and academic achievement. Not to mention, when we follow kids for other issues that affect productivity, so self-esteem, anxiety, depression levels, sense of social well-being, all of these improve with activity. So just like the kids' grades improve when we drop activity into their day, the same is true for adults. The science shows exercise improves concentration, memory, accelerates learning, enhances creativity, and lowers stress. Let's look at that last one, stress. That's a big roadblock for productivity. Exercise reduces stress in a number of ways, so chemically exercise reduces the level of the body's stress hormones, such as adrenaline and cortisol. It also stimulates the production of endorphins, chemicals in the brain that reduce pain and elevate mood. We also see behavioral changes. As you increase your fitness and your strength and stamina increase, your self-image can also improve. You'll learn a sense of mastery and control and self-confidence. We call this self-efficacy, our belief in our ability to do things. And this is a critical skill for productivity. Now, this is an emerging area of study, mostly self-report data. So, for example, one study looking at 200 employees of three different companies in the southwest of England compared the workers' output on days they exercised versus not. And on days they were more active, they reported managing their time better, being more productive, having better interactions with colleagues, and more satisfaction at the end of the day. Another trial in Sweden, where two and a half hours of their 40-hour work week were devoted to exercise, showed similar results. Workers reported that they got more done at work, had a greater work capacity, and were sick less often. To summarize, physical activity, even in 10-minute bursts, will not only help you be more productive, it'll also contribute to what the scientists call subjective well-being. Kind of their word for happiness. So what's stopping you? It's time to put a smile on your face, get moving, and go be more productive. Ready, set, let's up and go. Thanks for listening.